right, let's get this bike started. Have any of you guys ever built a wheel? Because I have not, and I don't think many people have. But the other day when I destroyed my uh, wheel, I had to buy this new one. Spank Spike Race 33, 26 inch. It's probably one of the only new 26 inch wheels out there. And then I got my old hub, DT Swiss uh, M1800 hub. And then uh, I went out and bought myself some DT Swiss Champion spokes, 258 millimeters. I'm really hoping they're the right length. And then just some DT Swiss uh, spoke nipples. We're gonna try and put this thing together. So I think today I'm gonna try to lace it all in tonight and then tomorrow try and true it up, which is the part I'm most worried about. But uh, yeah, let's get going. I've got a park tool video ready to watch on my phone. I'm not sure what's gonna follow this clip, but uh, here we go. So for thread prep, uh, we are using this oil in this can that I found in the garage. Half the spokes in on the left, half the spokes in at the right, all the silver spokes in. Uh, so I guess we will move on to the final two sets. save the truing, tensioning, dishing, and all that for tomorrow. All right, here we go, day two. Next morning, uh, got the wheel in the truing stand, as you can see, uh, looking good, hub sounded good. Uh, but as you can see, there's still no like tension really on the spokes. Um, so the next step, I believe, is I need to add like, one to three turns on each spoke just to get kind of a base tension and then we can start with like dishing it and truing it and radially truing it um which is the part i'm most nervous about so yeah i guess let's get to adding some tension <laughs> Absolutely beautiful. Um, that actually was a lot easier than I thought it would be, <laughs> surprisingly. Uh, with the help of a tutorial, and I think also having different colored spokes helped, it was pretty simple, I felt like. Um, probably took me, I don't know, 
maybe two hours total, which is not that bad at all. All right, so I'm gonna pause that outro right there just cause I wanna make a quick point about the video. So this video was originally supposed to be about kind of the trials and tribulations of wheel building. And as I'm editing it, I'm kind of realizing that I kind of wanted there to be some sort of struggle because then there's a story for me to tell when I'm editing the video. But it was actually a lot easier than I thought it was and it's a lot less daunting of a task as the internet kind of made it seem to me. So yeah, it actually did go as smoothly as it looks in the video. Um, and I'm kind of sorry that you didn't get as much of a story as you might have done if there had been some problems, but you know, that's the way it works out sometimes. You can't really complain because it was as good as I would have hoped. It was a pretty fun video to make and now my bike is working. Unfortunately, it was raining all day today and I don't have any time tomorrow to film and ride. Um, so I think next week's video is gonna be a riding video with the wheel, with Mitchell, hopefully. See if we can get him on board. That's the first video back. I hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe, and make sure you leave a comment. All right, peace out, everybody. I'll leave you with a little montage of the wheel on my bike. See ya. Perfect. Choose your fighter. Bye. Bye.